all her life Rebecca Kiwanuka has cooked with charcoal but it's both bad for her health and bad for the environment. It is also expensive. Now she has a special new stove. It costs a lot but it can still save her money. I used to use a lot of charcoal. I calculated each year I was using charcoal worth 1.2 million shillings in this home for one year. But now the, 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 the charcoal dust I use doesn't go even beyond 100,000. Volcanic rock is the key to this new eco stove. Once the rocks are heated, they remain hot for hours with the help of a solar powered fan that blows a continuous flow of air over them. The eco stove was invented by Rose Twine. She runs the company that makes them. We have a technology that can reduce more than 90% of the tree cutting in Uganda because with the eco stove you're using volcanic rocks which are burning more than charcoal burns, more than uh, firewood burns. It's clean, it's efficient, it's, uh, it's neat. The volcanic rocks can be used for about two years on average. The eco stove comes in various configurations, including large commercial ones like this range at a market in the capital Kampala where a thousand people come to eat every day. It's also beneficial for the cooks who use it because the device generates almost no smoke. Estimates say smoke from traditional stoves contribute to the death of almost 20,000 people a year in Uganda. The new stove is also more efficient than conventional designs. You can cook anything on these stoves and save a lot. The stoves have really helped us because after building them here, the company gives you the volcanic rocks. We have since given up using charcoal and only use charcoal dust, which we use to light the rocks. I now just spend a quarter of the money I used to spend on charcoal. In southwestern Uganda, at the foot of Mount Mohabura, EcoStove has provided new opportunities for farming families. It has trained and employed a number of groups to extract the rocks, which are later collected and taken to the company premises. When a truck comes, I get up to $100. I can use the money to pay school fees for my children, buy them clothes and food. Life is much better now because people buy these rocks. We used to grow crops and the stones got in the way of that, but now we're lucky enough to have someone pay for them. There is a large store of volcanic rocks at the Eco Stove factory. The company builds up to 40 stoves a day. Around 17,000 have been sold so far. Each comes with a small bag of rocks. Rose Twain says the device could be used in many regions and countries. We want to scale as many people to become entrepreneurs to be able to do exactly what we're doing in various parts of the country. We don't want to own the technology and it remains here. Uganda has a population of 40 million, 90% still cook with charcoal, so there is a huge potential market for the eco stove. The benefits could also be huge and help to slow the deforestation of the African continent.